Uh, right, recording. So, hi you guys, so welcome to my channel. I'm back with a new, highly requested video. We're gonna check out a documentary about a boxer here. See that he is a Ukrainian, so the flag there. And let's hope that I'm pronouncing his name right. Uh, Vasil Lumashenko, The Matrix is the documentary called. So, yeah, I'm not gonna ramble. Let's get straight into this video. <laughs> Alrighty, you guys, let's see. Vasil Lomachenko. Lomachenko. Tonight, he makes his professional debut. He is a two-time Olympic gold medal champion from Odessa, Ukraine. Tommy Gaspada Vasil. Hi, Vasil. Lomachenko. Vasil. Believes, uh, he has supreme confidence, doesn't believe anyone can beat him. Uh, when you win two gold medals in the Olympics and you only lose one out of 400 amateur fights, guess what? It breeds confidence. Arguably the greatest amateur fighter ever, mm. Loma's pro debut was highly anticipated. Typically, a fighter with potential will rev their career up over time. Vasily wanted no part of that. Oh! Survive punch combination gel, something you very rarely see nowadays. 396 amateur fights, of which he won 395. Oh, good, good Another amazing... Take it, guys! I'm gonna give you that! Good body shot. Oh. oh, another body shot knocked down. And Russell Moore is going to wave it off. <laughs> Ramirez went halfway across the world. Vasil. Hi, Ted. Yeah, cool it. Vasil Lomachenko. I had Lomachenko in my top 10 pound for pound when he had one pro fight. Oh, he got the title on were, each. I mean, what are you doing? How could you do that? I won't give it some time. Maybe you'll bumps. figure it out. Vasily's parents are the source of his strength. His mother was a gymnast. His father, a boxing trainer. Very good with Loma that. was trained by his father since okay. the time he was a literal baby. I started training when I was uh, four years old. Yeah, he's number one. He's the best. And I think his father is the best, too. Fight. Oh, that's him uh, doing some uh, sambo. Competing in a plethora of sports, okay. Vasily excelled in almost any athletic undertaking. Oh, football, wow. swimming, not football, soccer. Soccer, uh, dancing. You, you know the story where his father made him do traditional Russian dancing? And just made him learn that for footwork. It seems like his dad was just a mastermind architect of a Again, champion. Again, you guys, like the parents, when, when you know they're in their kid's life like that and involved is gold. And the Matrix is everywhere. It's gold. He entered the Keep professional arena, ready and able to contend for a title. When he was six, seven years old, his father insisted on four years of Ukrainian dance. And in just his second pro fight, he took his first shot. When you look at Lomachenko, you see exactly why this highly decorated amateur believes he can pull it off. You know, he had that amazing experience of 12 rounds against Orlando Salido, who came in overweight and outweighed him by maybe 20 pounds, and Salito fought a very rough and probably dirty fight. For the vacant WBO featherweight championship of the world. Ah. Round one. The fight was a difficult one for the Green Vasily. Facing a seasoned champion in just his second fight, it began with Vasily dominating the action. 307 or 397 amateur fights, 396 of them wins. And the one loss oh. was avenged. But it quickly devolved into repeated low blows from Orlando. Roy Jones Jr. commentated on it all night. Repeatedly, 
This kid threw low blow after low blow right there. Every time you see him let low blow, blow blow, you'll see Lomachenko dip and go down like right there. That's not okay, after right? The fight, it was counted that Orlando used 41 strikes below the belt. Oh, no. He was not docked a single point. There are some shots that Cole has to know or low that he's just missing. Look at chills. He's just a dreadful That's referee. Right. Referee big fights and somehow miss what How most long? other when people he's... in the arena can clearly see. So too late? Fouled Lomachenko a hundred times, and I don't even think that's hyperbole, and was lucky that he held on. To the winner by split decision, Orlando City. That's not right, though. He wasn't quite mentally ready for a tough, rugged guy that was going to take him 12 rounds and was going to cheat a little bit. But the experience would ultimately be a good one for Vasily. An experience he credits with preparing him for the tactics of inferior fighters in the future. As an amateur, Vasily racked up an otherworldly record of 396 wins to just one loss. Sheesh! Vasily is on the short list of two time gold medalists. Brazil. That's exactly what you see. You don't often find a guy who can win two gold medals consecutively back to back in the Olympics. That's like having a LeBron James and a Kobe Bryant come through all in his one. third fight. Loma would take on Gary Russell Jr., who was unblemished in 24 pro fights. Two time Olympic gold medalist introducing Vasily Loma. Machenko. And his opponent across the ring on my left. Introducing the undefeated Mr. Gary Russell Jr. Oh, I gotta check them out. I think it's gonna be a lot easier than what people think. I mean, he only had two fights. You know, so we're definitely gonna expose him on that. Uh, we got some tricks up our sleeve that we don't think okay. he's ready for. I thought Gary Russell Jr. was the greatest thing since sliced bread. He fought Lomachenko and I was like, who's this Russian dude? I didn't even know he was Ukrainian, never heard of him. Come on, that was a respectful. He took Russell apart. Let's watch again. Exposed In what? real time. Ay, 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 that didn't age well. For him to be able to compete for a world title in only two fights, it's, it's, it's a little shaky. It's a little shaky. You can't, uh, you can't take away from the laws of gravity. You know, if you jump up, you gotta come down. He outclassed Russell from start to finish. He gets inside, he steps around, he gets underneath the arms. He's never standing still, even if he's working in the pocket. Come on now, Gary. What did you Holding say about Russell's Manny? punches landed to a paltry 10%. Most dominant round for the fighter this round so far. Really fast fighter, and uh, Lomachenko completely outclassed him. Ooh, woo! Now Lomachenko going ay, 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 ay. The history and then the upper. Oh, he's still standing though. Gary's still standing, but that uh, looks a little wiggly. He's just taking hits of this one. Ay, 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 Handing ay, the previously unbeaten fighter his first loss. The leg. It's Lomachenko yeah. Well done. Terrific performance for Lomachenko. Like a chills. They certainly <laughs> believe I got chills about legs. Oh my god. Lomachenko. Vassal Lomachenko going up against Gary Russell and winning a world title and just his third fight. His third fight out. Wow. Anatoly is a genius. I mean, he really is a mastermind with tactics. Loma's training is a scientific process, unorthodox yet unquestionably effective, reminiscent to the approach Evander Holyfield took with his training. He started him very young. Been there he had the a whole process ride. that it's he was going to put him through all the way through. Yeah. Dad's a mad scientist. Yeah. To increase his stamina. Vasily practices holding his breath underwater for as long as he can. His record is four and a half minutes. My, my record was uh, four minutes, 30 seconds. What? Yeah. His father is really a mastermind when it comes to boxing. In your training, get ready for a 12-round fight. 
Instead, you spar 15 rounds, oh. and instead of three minute rounds, you do four minute rounds. Four minutes rounds. Instead of a minute rest, you do 30 second rounds. Yeah. In his fourth fight, Loma fought the Asia Pacific champ, who had an incredible record of 51 wins and only one defeat. And here's Lomachenko, regarded by many as the greatest amateur fighter of all time. One loss as an amateur, that loss twice avenged. Bottom line, he's the most precocious fighter of this age with this background ever to have appeared in the sport. The challenger is the WBO Asia Pacific champion. Number one contender in the sanctioning body. Lomachenko told his people, I want to fight one of the other belt holders. They said none of them are available. He said, then get me the number one contender. Roy Jones Jr. was amazed at the way the young Vasily navigated the ring. I have touched the ropes. He made a three quarters of a circle, maybe a 360 even, around the ring without his back, back ever touching the ropes. Combination throwing pressure fighters. He's a power punching pot shotter. And then all of a sudden, he's a fleet footed escape artist. He got a tendency to like challenge the opponent like, and expose them. And in his ways. First time in 53 fights that Okuria Peniel has been on the game. Well, that's the first time in 53 fights that he's it's seen by Steve Lobachinko. Even by special fighter standards, you're watching something special. A true exhibition of greatness. His, his hands move fast, his reaction and reflexes are super quick. He's using everything in his shows with the train. All to the winner by so unanimous well. decision. And still, and WBO works. World Champion, Vasily Lomachenko. The edict from Loma was clear. He was only interested in fighting meaningful fights. No record padding for him. Nobody can help but be impressed by how Loma fights, by the technical skill that he has. And we haven't seen that maybe since the first young Ali. That's some words right there. Loma is a nightmare of frustration. This explains the abnormal amount of cheap shots Loma's opponents deliver. And the refs don't usually see it. Time and again. They clearly see it. Lomachenko is just genetically like he's, he's laced with fast twitch muscles. It's breathtaking for guys like us who have been around the ring for a long time. It is a thing of beauty, and that's why he's already cracked my top five pound for pound list. You know, the guy who does it the best today about cutting angles and being right in front of you, you can't hit him, is Lomachenko. You could throw a punch and that punch could be in midair and he's spinning and he's already behind you. Uh, get Lomachenko out of here. Never seen that move. Another fast combination. And then he's over here and then he's punching you in the face and Lomachenko stands right in front of you and then he's not. Uh-huh. He can move. Oh, ay, ay, ay. I've never seen someone avoid punches and counter punch and switch. Like, he does some amazing things. I'm thinking, I'm I've been boxing a long time. That I'm that like, how do you do that? I'm like, how do you practice that? His fluidity and ability to dance around the ring help him to be in the right place at the right time. Every time. I mean, they can't read someone like that. Uh, and Rodriguez is down for the five, second time. Six, seven, eight. Nine! He is the winner by way of knockout. He is still the WBO featherweight champion of the world, Vasily Lomachenko. Very What's fascinating to me is in your training that you get, you post online, I see on the countdown videos. I mean, who comes up with this stuff? Is it your father? You're doing the reaction drills. This is a um, special exercise for mind flexibility. You need to switch from muscle work to intelligence work. Loma also trains in skating, juggling, tennis, 
and gymnastics. Traditional boxing exercises are alternated with non-standard methods. Anything that may aid in some way to his Mama! boxing repertoire. He's doing it all. All my boxing life, he gave me a special exercises. I do not boxing, not boxing exercises. Yeah, yeah. unconventional. Yeah. Yeah. You see. Yeah, his training regimen is pretty brutal, yeah. and they said it was just crazy the, the hours that he puts in, how he trains, how hard he trains, and some That's of the drills that he does. The way he, he's so agile with the stepping of his feet. It's like, I think a lot of people are going to learn and mirror that. In his seventh professional fight, Loma moved up in weight to face off with the junior lightweight champion, Rocky Martinez, in Madden Champion. Why is he so effective in the ring? Oh, there's so many reasons. Well, I'll start with technique. His technique Jeez. is impeccable. In his next fight, Loma would take on an undefeated oh. champion, Nicholas Walters. Nicholas. Please don't this one out. Only a special fighter and a special performance wins a matchup like this. They're both special tonight. Walters was a knockout artist, a genuine star. <laughs> Makes guys keep their hands at home a lot with the small or the light offense. Then once he gets settled at home, he brings a bomb. And Lomachenko, as he did to Gary Russell Jr., is just so turning it into a boxing match. Loma embarrassed him. Dominating the fight from start to finish. The way he seems to know exactly what he wants to do from moment to moment. No, I don't want to No, I don't want to Continue. No, okay. You're stopping the fight. I respect him. Wow. That's astonishing. Look at the sportsmanship. I got blues one. Wow. The tradition wow. in American, North American boxing never is seen a this. champion no, would not wanna... stop fighting at that moment. A finish that came via Walters quitting on his stool. Shades of Leonard versus Duran. No mas. You're not supposed How? to quit in boxing. You know, you're not supposed to cry in baseball. You can't quit in boxing. Prince's very own Vasil Lomachenko has been recognized as the best boxer in the I world. What makes Vasily Lomachenko Sheesh. the best, then? Because his style is so unorthodox. Most of the time, he's southpaw, but then he, he switches his hands, switches his legs. Ranked pound for pound best fighter in the world by ESPN, the Ring Magazine, and writers, the Boxing Writers Association of America. Lomachenko has a record that you will look at and wow. say, wait a minute, this guy's not experienced, but he is. Lomachenko's attempting to also become one of the greatest pros ever, and there have been very few careers that have been this good, this fast. Another combination upstairs. Lomachenko, too much hand speed. Loma attempted to fight any of the other belt holders in his division willing to fight him. They were all afraid. <laughs> So Loma defended his belt against Jason Sosa. And by the way, how about the stamina? Stamina. Look nice. at that move. That move Just now, man, punch combination. combination. I can't think of anyone <laughs> quite like Lomachenko. He's showing us Body something new. Says it all. If you look at Lomachenko, he takes those steps to the right and to the left, sort of like Mike Tyson used to do to set up his punches from the right or left. And for the second straight fight, Loma made his opponent quit on their stool. And now they're going to stop. Good for Rivas. Correct call. Good job. Absolutely. Yeah. Wow. Loma yeah. was now being dubbed. Antics played. Vasily Lomachenko. Breaking his will. With both speed and defensive out, prowess, every right which thing. way, I mean, every which that way, seen. saying that, hey, I am the best. Wow. I fear no Luma. man, not you. You Luma. can't hit me, Luma. and I can hit you. Yes, in Colombia, Colombia, Venezuela. 
again. Ay, 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 ay. For the third straight time, his opponent quit on his stool. That is it. Fight is over. Mariano. The girl walking over. There's no, no a wrong. TKO victory <laughs> for the seventh number champion. Domaschenko struck again, winning by way of submission. You're fighting for the first time in the history of boxing that two two time gold medalists are getting in the ring. Lomachenko, he dodges punches like Neo dodges bullets. Fittingly, he's been nicknamed the Matrix. The Matrix is everywhere. It is all around us. I see now what they Even mean now, with the Matrix. Very, I see. You can see it when you look out your window. Next thing I know, I'm two or three rounds into it, and I'm going, he's playing with Brigandel. Yeah. He's playing with him. He's very low key. Like... He's beginning to believe. But it's all but he's loud. Look at, his, look at his feet. Unfortunately, no one can be told what the Matrix is. You have to see it for yourself. He is the Matrix with his angles. The other title holders were understandably less than enthusiastic about being dismantled in the Matrix. Undefeated world champion, and he's toying with him. He is the one. He's not coming out to continue against Roy. Another opponent quitting on his stool, submitting to the will Have of Lomachenko. Like yeah, I'm just... giving a new name to Lomachenko. No Mas Chanko. Mm -hmm. There it is. That's the fight that really sold me on Lomachenko, that he's that good. 11 and... fights in, he wins his third world title. What in the f***? From 130 pounds to 135 from junior lightweight. The lightweight. Loma would move up and wait again to face off with the lightweight world champion, Jorge Linares. I was wondering Linares. whether uh, Vasily had bitten off more than he could chew. Now it was time to see who's the best fighter in the world is now. Linares and Lomachenko, round number one for the lightweight title. In a quest to secure his third title in yet another division. Linares was considered the number one lightweight in the world. A real challenge for the Matrix. The fight was a back and forth affair early. Quick combination from Lomachenko. Touched him to the body and then split the guard upstairs. Loma was the more skilled, but Jorge had a large size and power advantage. Yes. The smaller man wants to be in. And there really is quite a size difference. You can just see it. Then, in the sixth round, Loma got caught. Mm. Oh, the is calling! Lomachenko goes down! What a turn! He was fine right away. Uh, and like I said, he showed another dimension. For the first time in his career, Loma was knocked down. The momentum switched, and Linares went on the attack. Nine, they were not old. Ay, ay, ay. But Loma persevered, delivering a lethal combination that culminated with a devastating body shot. Right? 
the win shattered the record for the fewest fights needed to secure titles in three divisions. There was no resting on his laurels after winning his third title. Instead, Loma aimed to unify the lightweight belts against Jose Pedraza. He fades second half. You cannot fade against the Matrix, Lomachenko. There's a left hand from Lomachenko. Shut up to the lefty. There you go. There you go. Fox in with a lead left hand that time Love against Pedraza. That's exactly what I was talking about from the first he round. He knocks down the jab of Pedraza and throws a straight left hand down the middle. The fight was mostly one-sided. Loma left. landed an incredible 46% of his 345 power punches. Just landed in that 11th round. WBA and WBO lightweight champion of the world, the Vasily Lomachenko. But this is levels above. This is one of the great fighters of the last 10, 20 years in Lomachenko, who just seems to be getting stronger and better, and he wants more. Loma destroyed Anthony Carolla. Perfect timing. Mike! Inside the first minute of the fourth, that is definitively the end of the fight. And Vasil Lomachenko proved his utter class in dismantling the brave Anthony Crawler, who needs some time here. You know, four belts, it means you are, you are the best in your weight classes. The best. You are one, one world champion, not four world champion, you won. In his next outing, Lomachenko captured his third belt in his fourth weight class. How good is Lomachenko? I think he's the best pound for pound fighter in the world. Campbell was a much larger fighter than Loma. Lomachenko's a guy who moved up from featherweight, so most people now are gonna be the naturally bigger guy. <laughs> Lomachenko doesn't move it, he glides. He glides, he's like, yeah. so glides, smooth, yeah. man. That's that ballet coming through. It's yeah. true. It's something to watch, man. It's just the, the, the ability to, to move and also to anticipate the other fighter's movement. This guy is the wizard of footwork. It's crazy because he's like right in front of you. But he's one step ahead of you at every turn. Loma was sharp. He dictated the action, staying aggressive, landing awesome. cursing body shots, chopping away at the much larger fighter. He wants to be matched only with the best. Vasily Lomachenko is considered by most boxing experts to be the pound-for-pound -pound best fighter on the planet. How high he climbs on the all-time list will be one of the biggest stories in boxing over the next several years. Wow. Vasily Lomachenko, The Matrix. Nobody wow. brings it home like Joe wow. Vincent. Nobody. Wow, 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 That's all I have to say, you guys. Sheesh, I didn't see this. I didn't expect this. <laughs> this was crazy. I see why you guys told me that I have to check him out. Vasil Lomachenko. This is amazing.
in so many different ways like comment down below what you guys think like this video subscribe all that good stuff and hopefully i will see you guys in the next one appreciate you watching bye <laughs>